Hey there, stampers and crafters. <laughs> Welcome to the Stamp and Scoop show. I am oh, Tammy me. White, and this is Linda Cullen, and we are making all kinds of ruckus in the background here. We have the volume up. You know, it's always, it's always something, isn't it? Your technology is just a wonderful thing. So, you love it, yeah. or you hate it. Yeah, Today's yeah, a little yeah. more in the hate. Yeah, 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 yeah. But we love you, yes. and we are very happy to be here today. Wait, do you see what we got? I'm so excited. freaking real. We're so excited about this new product line that Stampin' Up! is releasing officially to customers on November first oh, i know i'm so <laughs> excited <laughs> <laughs> it is freaking awesome these are alcohol based markers Cheers. called stampin blends we have Thanks. been waiting a long time for these oh, so they match our color lines they are phenomenal they are we have a, we have a everything you need to know to get started yes. with the stampin blends markers episode so you're all ready come the first of the <laughs> month you know what to expect yes um, before we get started, well, we got we a few have things. We got housekeeping. All to do. kinds of things to go. And and when we say housekeeping, it's not like the kind oh of, no, this is it's the best not housekeeping. Like the dust that's all over my desk. We're talking about yep. the good stuff that you guys can get. Free. I try to do more of this and less of the other one. Yeah, right, <laughs> right. So we have some free giveaways for you guys, as always. When we have a live, um, a live broadcast, we love to like say thank you to you guys. Um, yep. And this is one way we do that. At so at the end of this episode, we'll be drawing three. Oh, lucky winners of three hostess sets, oh. which are very hard to get. Yeah. These hostess sets you can only get with Stampin' Rewards. Or with or. my frequent buyer point program. Right, right. But they're not they're not the regular sets that you can buy. Right. So you can earn them free and all you need to do is leave a comment here on either mine or Linda's um and Facebook say something page. nice. We like nice. We love nice, <laughs> yes. So we're gonna tell you what you wanna include yes. in that comment yes. next because <gasps> Um, it, right here is our after live, which is for based on the people that either can't watch live or didn't win one of the three yep. other prizes. Yep. And um, mm -hmm. if you leave a comment the same exact way you enter on mine or Linda's Facebook page, we're live on Facebook right yep. now. Um, you will be entered to win any of these drawings. Now, the, what we're going to tell you what you want to type in those comments is the word yeah. shared with the D with the D. And the reason for that is um, you're not just going to want to type that. You actually yes. have to do the, yes. <laughs> you have to yes. have to share it. If you share the video on Facebook from either YouTube or Facebook on to either mine or Linda's, uh, from mine or Linda's channels, yes. either, either one, yes. we broadcast yes. simultaneously and then type the word shared. <laughs> you will get a second entry into our after live drawing. And that is for the love Look today player this. kit. Oh, that is a this is phenomenal awesome. kit. Everybody's dying for this yes. kit. It's a great kit. And it's just our way of saying thank you. Thank you for yes. watching. Thank you for, for being a part of our show. Being so supportive of both of us. And you know, it's like a game show. We like to, we like prizes. <laughs> we like prizes and we Ding, 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 ding. We wish I could see you running down the aisles, you know, like, <laughs> <laughs> that's the one part I miss right here. Ba -na -na. We but, need a game theme yeah, song. You know what? We're, come 2018, I think we definitely Ooh, need a theme song. We're going to work right. on that. We are cool. definitely going to work on that. <laughs> Little hearts. Hearts so, galore for the theme song. I love the hearts. Okay, that's awesome. <laughs> so, um, and in giving with these freebies, um, we are... <laughs> Going Sorry. to draw a winner in a minute <laughs> oh, for our last episode. Now, November 7th is the deadline to enter for the kit, for the planner kit. Yes. And that is the date of our next Stampin' Scoop show, which will be episode 30, uh, 43. 43. We're 43. 42. We we're 42 even, today. Can't even keep track anymore. Oh, I know. We're, I know. We've reached that age where we don't <laughs> want to celebrate birthdays anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, well, it will be, it is the 20th anniversary yes, of our 40th of our, show. Yes, 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 yes. We're 29 forever. No. <laughs> no. Yeah, we actually, we love doing these this shows. Is this fun. is actually one of the highlights. In fact, I'm going to tell you right now, I was grumpy grumpy yeah. earlier today, but, you know, there's something about yeah. the Scoop show that brings the magic and we love doing it. How can we, this is so fun. I, I mean, know. And hello. you know what? It's the time that we get to spend with you guys and interact with you guys. We get to play with the products and show you how to play with them. It's just yeah, um, and we get to share cool stuff. I like know. Today. So oh, we're going to draw the winner for episode 42, which is the Snowflake Sentiments Bundle, stamp set and dies. And we're going to do that in just a minute. Um, and while you guys are popping on, because we don't yep. want the winner to miss their oh, announcement. Oh, no, you want to see when. We're going to tell you, we're going to tell you about what's happening in the Stampin' World, because there's oh, some exciting there's things. There's a lot on. of stuff going on. Um, yesterday, uh, Stampin' Up! released 
Oh my um, goodness. Some extra kits, these October Octobers. paper pumpkin kits. And they had a big, big note. They gave us a notice ahead of time, which we appreciate. They yep. said, we have a limited amount of these. We're going to release them at 2 o'clock yep. yesterday. We got the word out as quickly as we could Good. so that everybody knew about it. And and, they and flew even off said, the they're going to go in nanoseconds. Yes. And they did. They went in 30 yes. minutes. All the kits sold out. Yep. I have a couple of kits. I have a couple. So I don't have a lot, but <gasps> if you missed out, if you missed out on getting it, email me at Tammy at stampwithtammy.com. Uh -oh. And if I still have them left, first come, first serve. But if I still have the, the few that I got left, uh, I'll let and you know. What you, you Now do you realize this entire show, we're going to hang. Bing, 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 bing. Don't even bother commenting here on Facebook because I can't bing, keep bing, up. Bing. You do need to email me if you didn't get if, if you didn't get the kit and you really wanted it. And like I said, the first email to come to me. So if you're, if you're typing a comment here on Facebook for it, I the first say, emails that come to me get get the ones that I have. I'm going to start vibrating. <laughs> off the little stand. <laughs> okay, so that's a, that's the news on the October paper pumpkin kit. So I have a couple. I don't have a lot, but I have a couple. And the first people to email me that that want it, I just I'll tell you. you know, Mary, email Tammy <laughs> now. I see her. I want one. There. Oh, you email me now, Tammy at stampwithtammy.com. Okay. <laughs> so um, on top of that, okay. Oh, you know what? I'll put that right up there on the screen, right there. Oh, there you go. There it is. The pining for plaid kit. I don't have a is lot, the but the first ones oh, to email me. And the order that the emails come yep. in, that's the that's the ones that get it. Tammy at stampwithtammy.com, and I'll and I'll just let you know how much they are and how you can pay for it. Um, the buy three get one free designer series oh. paper sale is ending in a few days. Stock up, you got to stock up. Yeah, everybody's been stocking up. It's yes. a great, great special. So that's awesome. Hi, Dominic. Dominic. Oh, Tell him he can color along with us I today. I know, I know. He's so cute. Sabrina's <laughs> grandson. We love that he watches along. He's like our little, our little cheerleader. We love him. So don't miss out on the sale. Don't miss out on this opportunity to stock up on the paper. There are details on both Linda and my yes. blogs, and the links are in the video description. Yes, they are. Um, coming up next, um, the Stamp Out Breast Cancer Fundraiser, our eighth annual. Um, that is the, the actual event is in Massachusetts this weekend, but you do not need to be local to be a part of this. Awesome, awesome uh, fundraiser for making strides against breast cancer. That's Currently, a... we've reached our 45% um, mark. Wow. 45%. We've raised $2,600 so far. Oh, here's, yeah, so here's our graphic. little tally. Here's our little tally <laughs> from this morning. I pulled this from the um, from the fundraising site this morning. All of this money goes directly to the American Cancer Society. We've all donated everything for it. And when you make a donation to our um, breast cancer fundraiser, you will get a free card tutorial. You will get Ooh. entry into win a full set of stamp and write markers, a full set of <gasps> ink pads, two hundred and seventy dollars. That's wow. everything, including both new ink pad collections. And wow. All the ink pads. So, I mean, that's that a is huge, awesome. huge, 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 you get entry to win that, and you'll get entry to win a Keurig coffee pro. Ooh, yeah, I just had to buy a, a brand new one. That's yeah. awesome. That's a little perk. So, um, the details of that are on my blog, if you're interested in, in donating. We really appreciate it. Our goal is to raise $6,000, and we also have newly designed t-shirts. I should have worn my t-shirt. Oh, yeah. What was I thinking? I should have worn my t-shirt. <laughs> They're awesome. Everybody's loving those t-shirts. Tamara Davis designed them. She does so, a good job. Yeah, very excited about that. And in other news, I have decided to offer a craft, I'm calling it Crafty Stampin' Blends Club. If you want to get all the blends, but you may be like, I can't really do them all in one month. I've got you covered. Four months, you're going to get all the blends and you're going to get a lot of extra stuff that's going to go with it. Head over to CraftyStampin.com. All the details are there. And I would love to have you join me. I actually am amazed at how many I've sold so far. So jump in, join that group and uh, come along for a ride. <laughs> yeah, so the stamp and blend markers we're about to show yeah. you guys. Linda is actually starting a club, so you can yes. get them on get a little them. bit of a budget. A little easier. I you also get... have a stamp club. It's not specifically to blends, yeah. but you can use it. It's... So her information's on her blog. Yep. You her can um, get that at craftystampin.com. Yeah. Um, and uh, the one other little stamp and blends. Um, little goodie oh, that we this. have here if you are in our stamp it demonstrator group yes. now or you are about to join it especially if you want to get these blends at a discount uh, or even join us free right yeah we have this cute little box Isn't that i put together adorable? from the october paper pumpkin box yeah, i so it's one of the kits box. i made i put oh. all the blends in the box and i'm giving them away to the stamp it demonstrator group along, along with the, the color me happy project Which kit that you're about to see we're going to show that off later today and the, the, the color stamp me set. Happy there is a set. Set. Challenge to our group out there. We've we've thrown it out there, and the girls have been. I mean, it's awesome. 
It is absolutely awesome. And everybody has in our group has the opportunity to win these free from me. So that's just an added perk. And if you want more information on that, you can click. And on... I will tell you, we have not had so much fun in our group I know. since it's this went awesome. out because we're having to do little Facebook lives to introduce ourselves in our group. And that's, oh yeah. my God, it's so much fun to meet <laughs> everybody. We've been, been awesome. having a blast. So. It's been awesome. And so um, joining Stamp the Stamp a Demonstrator group, you yep. can join with either me or Linda yep. and be a part of the group. So either way, you are part of our family and a part yes. of our group and you have the opportunity, but that is being drawn on um, October 31st. So First. join now so, so email either of us we'll yeah, give you more we details you on joining more details on joining yeah okay so we are ready to draw the winner of the last episodes two weeks ago um the snowflake bundle which yes. is the snow snowflake sentiments that we showed on the last episode and the die uh, set swirly snowflakes so we are going to pop over to maybe um, get into the right page here. We're going to pop over to random.org. Yes. And what you see here, and I'm going to go through it real quick, is um, a list of everybody who left a comment on either Facebook or YouTube video on either my channel or Linda's. They both count. Yep. Now, you may notice that you see a few names multiple times. You see them twice. Twice is the, the limit here. Um, and if you see somebody's name twice, that means that they shared the broadcast and they Wait. typed in shared, 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 shared with a D because we use an Excel program yeah. to, to pull actually pull that up. So I'm just scanning through here so that you guys can, um, see, hopefully see your name in there. And in a second, we are going to hit the randomized number and whoever is on top or button. Whoever's on top, when I hit this little button right here, is our winner. So good luck to Yay. everybody who was a part of our last episode. And um, if you're new to the Stamp and Scoop, welcome. And you have the opportunity to win on this episode, which we'll draw next this week. Next episode. Next in two weeks. Yeah. In two weeks. <laughs> okay, so the winner Whoa. is Michelle Keeley. Yay. Congratulations, Michelle. Congratulations. So that is that is very, very <clears throat> cool. You have just earned yourself the the um, snowflake bundle. The awesome snowflake sentiment bundle. She sells <laughs> seashells by the well, seashells. I, someone I just that. suggested that we use it. the I Love Lucy theme for Ooh. our. Uh, that would work for us yeah, on days. You know the chocolate know, right? scene, and, and the, then if yeah. we could just get the you know that little that little ditty that they play when she's really blundered yeah. something yes, up. Yeah, we need that we all the operate. time. <laughs> Yeah. All the time. There's one big long blooper on this one. Yes. Yes. We'll see if I can color within the lines today. Yeah. But you know what? Sometimes you don't need to color. No. In, in, okay. Janet says, I'm only seeing half of a screen. You're probably only oh. seeing a square. And we found this happens sometimes if you um, come in before the show starts. If you just pop out and pop back in again, you should see the full landscape. Yeah. Um, the full landscape of the show. Hopefully. Um, that will work this Facebook time. Facebook tweaks. I know. You know what? Just technology. Sometimes it's awesome. Sometimes it's not. And some it's not always consistent. No. Works for some. It doesn't work for all. Wait, all I, right. I'm not even going to try to go there. <laughs> so let's talk about the Stampin' okay. Blends. Wow, wow, wow. Um, I'm going to pop on over here, um, give you yes, a little ma'am. sneak peek here at what's coming in a second. This is the Stampin' Blends brochure that is going to be available this afternoon from uh, in our um, resources page from yep. Linda and I. Um, you will find this, um, and it is all the information that we're about to share with you um, on the Stampin' Blends. It's a little bro brochure. talks about um, how to use the Memento ink that we're going to show you, how to use the blends, what blends are available, and the Color Me Happy project kit that we're about to use. So yes. I'm just going through it a little bit quickly, yeah. um, but we're going to talk about this in detail um, in just a second. Yep. Both the kit and that stamp set, when they come out in November, will be a limited time right. offer. The blends are sticking around, and but as that we know set, with limited time offers, it's like yes. when Apple comes out with a product and all of a sudden oh, yeah. it sells off the shelf and then you can't get it. Yes. In, in our case, it's not available ever again. So right. Right. <laughs> get them yes. early. <laughs> yes. Okay, so that is a little um, sneak peek <clears throat> at the brochure. You'll be able to catch that this afternoon on both Linda and my blogs. And now I am going to pop down to the table and we are going to get started. Okay, All right, well, let's let me show off the actual product first. I made cases, <laughs> but easy for transport. So <laughs> Zena says her son's trying to eat her phone. I know. I love Don't when eat that it. Don't eat it. So let's, we need that. So here are the blends. The blends come in. There's two colors per color. So pool party. There's a pool party dark and a pool party light. So each one has two. Then there is an additional skin tones of ivory, 
bronze, and then there's the color lifter. So we'll explain those in a minute, but we'll stick with in general. So the markers themselves have two tips. There is a... Susan, we see you. She says face. she's being told Facebook is not responding, but we are getting your comments. <laughs> <laughs> and Janet now can see the whole screen oh, after good. she went out and got back in. So if anybody oh, else good. only sees a square, pop out, pop back in, and you should see the whole landscape All right. view. So there is a nib end, and then there is a... I'll use the black so you can... Catherine wants to know, where can I get them? These end. will be available November 1st. Yes. Um, on our In our online stores, unless you sign up to be a demonstrator. And actually, you can't even demonstrate. You can't get, can't get them again until November 1st. Yep. We had a special pre-order. Yeah. But November 1st, they'll be available. We're giving you a little sneak peek and a 101. 101. So you have the brush and the nib. And you can see these uh, lines on either side. There's a thin line and a darker line, a thicker line. The thicker line is the brush end. The thin line is the nib end, so you know which end you're working with before you take the caps off. These are alcohol-based markers, so the caps need to fit on nice and tight, and you will hear them snap, and you want to make sure they snap when you close them so they stay um, juicy. They need to sit um, horizontal somewhere on your desk. You don't want them stacked up in a uh, jar or something. You want to store them like this. You, They are... A square barrel so when you put them down oh, they're not that. all going to roll off because I always have all of them <laughs> all over my, my I desk. I my stamping rights they go all yep. over the place. So that adds me see. So you get the light and the dark. All right. So um, someone is asking do they come in a storage box? Not yet but no. we have been making our own. We're I made my own out of a paper pumpkin box and yep. Linda is using the. I'm using the wood mount cases. Which we, we do sell. Those are in our yes, online stores. Yes we sell these. These are part of my club <laughs> and I'm also sending the uh, inserts to the club members. So little perks. Um, all right so then let me see. So we're just, like the I'm, Tupperware snap. Yes, exactly yes, like the yes. Tupperware snap, Joanna. Yeah. So you want to make sure that you do snap them when you're done. So here is a, and let me see if I get this in nice so you can see them, a sample of the colors we have. So right now, oh, I did too much. Hold on, ladies. Hold on. So we have 12 colors. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, yep. four, five, six, seven, eight, right. nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yep. Plus Stampin' Up Blends. Bronze and, and um the ivory. And so so we have Night of Navy. So we're gonna do all these. Uh Bermuda Bay, Pool Party, Old Olive, Rich Raspberry, Pink Pirouette, Cherry Cobbler, Calypso Coral, Pumpkin Pie, Daffodil Delight, Crumb Cake, Smoky Slate. And this one is the ivory and the uh, bronze. It's not usually in the family. <laughs> it's the same, it's the same. So here I just took the boot from Country Living and colored each one so I could get an idea of what each one can do. Um, and so that is my sample of those. I also, for my own thing, made a little chart. And I've got all the colors, and I colored each one, and then I did a blending where I put the light on one side, the dark on the other side, so I can see what they can do. Um, what I might do next is go down the side and use the color lifter. And I'll explain a little more of the lifter when we get using them. These charts also will be on our blogs yes. following yep. the episode. Yep. Those boots are from the Country Living Country stamp Living, set. yep. So what I suggest when you get them, so you want to, when, when you get going with your blends, you need... Memento ink. This is the ink that you need to use with the blends. What you want to do is you want to stamp with them. You need to let it dry. Now, this, our inks dry very quickly, um, which is great, but you want to give it a little extra time. So I sometimes will stamp stuff and then go do something, or I hit it with the heat gun. You want to make sure they're really dry before you start coloring because the alcohol will pull it up if you don't. So just make sure it's dry, then they won't run. Memento ink. Um, I suggest... A practice sheet so go get a bunch of your outline stamps stamp them all over our whisper white they are designed to work with our whisper white paper and then just start coloring the wonderful thing with these is you just get to sit and relax ah, I got it. I and got play it. My <laughs> throwing we said phone around <laughs> tammy's phone was gonna fall off mine fell off <laughs> that was me i yep. was trying to put it up so we could read yep. the comments my suggestion when you're brand new is to start with the nib end um, the brush end gives out a lot of ink, which is great because it really gives you rich colors, but sometimes you can get a little too much. So I s suggest new, start with the nib, 
then move to the brush. You'll get used to it. I, I, the first time I did it, I did the brush. I had it all outside the lines, switched to the nib, practice a little bit, and now every one of them's inside the lines. So it takes, it takes a little bit of practice, but you will be great, easy, very easy to pick it up once you start doing it. Um, and I'll show you some samples of what I did. So here is the bunny. This is from Garden Girl stamp set. Here he is in smoky slate and in pink pirouette ivory and bronze and crumb cake. Um, here is the puppy from, oh goodness, lost the name of the oh, puppy. Oh, is that the Bella? Bella Bella's, the Bella? Bella's something. Bella and Friends? Bella and Friends, that's it. This yellow, I decided, here's a, the regular yellow. It was, I have a golden retriever, I had a golden retriever. They're not yellow <laughs> like a duck. So I colored him first in crumb. And then I added yellow over it to dull the yellow down more like what you would find a dog do or dog be dog do, do doggy do, do. Yeah. doggy do yeah doggy do wouldn't doggy be this do. color but yeah. there we go <laughs> we might have a color for that <laughs> so that's my advice to just get like going. the poop emoji we yeah. can do that so let's see another so let's all right 101 so let's go look at the products that come with the kit so this is the Color Me Happy stamp set and the project kit, the Color Me Happy project kit. So well, let's open the other one and show off the product because mine, I made a mess and then I'll put this one all back nice and neat before <laughs> we put it away. Oh, it's only going to our team members. Yeah, this one's going to a Stampin' yeah. Demonstrator. Yep. Stampin' oh, Demonstrator group if you're watching. Sealed. I don't want to make it sealed. All right, I'll just figure out how to make it nice and neat. I don't want to open it up. That wouldn't be nice. <laughs> So in this kit, this kit was a lot of fun. So with normally with our kits, you get the instructions, pictures of what to do. Uh, it tells you what's in the kit, your coordinating colors, full detailed instructions, plus pictorial. This is where I head. I head straight for the pictures. Yeah. What do I need I to do? I think that helps. Yep. And so here we got, these are a banner. We have gold foil edged uh, die cuts cardboard we don't need to see we have quite a few die cuts Let me see if I can... oh you're, you're reaching for my face uh, so here we have we'll go back to those the, <laughs> the some this is the color cuts. me happy Gold. kit janet yep and it will be available on november 1st while supplies last yes um a pre-printed uh lantern gold foil uh starburst dies and then a bunch of the paper already cut for you to stamp on I'm trying to put the accessories all together. This was the one I worked with today. So it's a bit all over the place. So here is more paper, more die cuts in great colors. Here we go. Here comes the real pretty. All right. So we get envelopes. Oh, I love these. these. I think this love is four them. by four. Here's the inside of the envelopes. Then this one's my favorite. Oh. I think it's rich raspberry with the gold and then the leaves on the inside. So pretty. So then we have the pool party. I love, I just love this gold foil banding. That is And awesome. then pink pirouette. Those are your awesome. envelopes. Here are your card bases. We get the pink pirouette. This is a four by four. We get a graphic square design. I don't know if you can see that well. And another four by four. And then a traditional, um, is it A2? Uh, in the Knight of Navy and rich raspberry but then here's the good stuff so then we have a gold foil tape i want to call it washi tape but it's not washi tape because it's gold foil and that is just i wish we would come out with those oh that this is, is fun so yes. cool yes and then all right so then and that's sticky and that's sticky Ooh. oh it was so nice so easy to work with once oh, i did oh, it i was like oh, oh i want nice. more of this nice. all right look at these adorable pool party tassels Aren't those cute? Oh, those are yummy. Okay, let me get those back in here so I don't lose them. Oh, here we go. I'm saving the good stuff for last. Um, we got some white baker's twine to make all sorts of pretty things. And then, let's see if you can see these through the bag. These are rich raspberry pool party and gold foil sequins and stars. Oh my God, these are so yummy. Oh, lots of hearts. Take, lots of hearts. If I take Just them out by. of the bag to get rid of That's the glare, awesome. I'm going to have a mess all over Tammy's floor. So I'm not oh, going to do no, that. No, take them out. Take, take them out. out. Right. Absolutely. Right, Those are my favorite part. Put it on that gray. 
All right, here we go. Mess in Tammy's room. Yeah, we're going to play with there it later. There we go. You see Sometimes I find those sequins left over after a class, <laughs> and I actually, like, will put them on stuff. Oh, really? Like, that I'm working on. I love these colors. <laughs> They'll be I stuck did. to my, my table underneath, and yeah. I'll be like, oh, look what I found. The Here we ra- go. The Razzleberry is oh, just it's, it's yummy. It's so awesome. All right, hold on. Like I said, I'm now going to have them all over the place. Oh. All right, here, I'm going to hand this to you. Oh, you figure out how you're back in the back bag. <laughs> I did make you take them out, but it was worth it, wasn't okay. it? Look at the little stars. So let me show oh, you my the stars. finished cards that that kit makes. Now, I tried to stick to exactly what the um, instructions said. And as I was hustling myself around along this morning. To the hustle. Trying to do that, do, 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 I do, stamped do, do, on the do, wrong do, do. side. So immediately I had to change. So this, this one's supposed to angle the other way. But if you want to go rogue, I'm blaming it on, I just went rogue. Um, you can stamp on the other side and make it go larger on the top and smaller on the bottom. But you get to stamp these uh, flower images from the stamp set and then color them with the pink pirouette and then add your uh, sequins. And then there's this one of the little three by threes. This is the thank you. So, so cute with the gold foil. You can see the gold foil. And then here's another one with the two little birds, which are adorable. And it says, oh, hello. Oh, hello. And then this one is my favorite from the bunch with the lanterns. Oops, slide him over. And the um, little tassel on the side. And I think that's so pretty. And I love, this is what you can do with these blends. Oh, my hearts are coming. More hearts are coming. Is have this variation to have it lighter in the middle and make it look like they're illuminated. I think that's so cool. All right, so do I color something or do I show them cards first? Color. Which one? Color? Color? All right. So let me find my... Oh, I don't know. You can pull the group. I was just saying, what do we want? What do you guys want? Do you want her to show you cards or do you want her to color first? Let's see. As I just have to scroll down, it would be a cute baby card with the birds. Yes, the birds would make an adorable baby card. Looking, does the kit come with the stamp set? Nope, the stamp set and They're the separate. kit are separate, but I do believe there's a bundle. They cheaper with the bundle? Hold on. We always love a good bundle. Love you back, Kathy. There you go. Save 10% and you can get them bundled. So Ooh, that is that's, how that is, works. That's a good deal. Again, while we supplies love last on those. The bundles. The blends Color. will be in the next catalog, but the, the kit and stamp set are while I'm getting a last. combo of color and cards <laughs> <laughs> all right i'm gonna color because i got it out all right so these are alcohol markers so they will so here's my, my our regular sheet. black ink does not work with the alcohol no. markers that's why we need the momentum. need the momentum they will go through they're supposed to go through it's okay i actually think I know. I, I, that's what makes them so rich. Is yes. the, the bleed through is actually part of it. And so I, do make sure that you, yes, <laughs> you protect yes. your so your back. I actually think I can tell I've done a good job <laughs> if the back looks good. <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of funny that you can see you your can image really see right the through shading. there. You can see that puppy right through the paper. Yeah. So know that before you start. So I brought my uh, grid paper to color on so I don't ruin Tammy's uh, wood here. So I was gonna color the little bunny. Let me, uh, okay, Woo. let's see. All right, so let me see. So I wanted to do, I'm gonna, so what I also plan to do is make little notes so that I remember what colors I use to make these um, so that next time I go, yep, yeah, that's what I want my bunny to be, that I just know I'm gonna grab the two pink pirouettes. So I think the bunny I am gonna do in the pink because I think I liked him the best. Let me find my two pink pirouettes, dark and light. And mean, your water minder app would like you to drink some more water. Okay, hold it on. just buzzed. It hold just on. buzzed and popped got, up. There we go. Okay. And said, "Please drink water." She actually Thank has you. an app to remind yes. her to drink her water. And I tend to ignore it. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not really. That's helping what me. I'm here for. Okay. So anytime you need me to read your phone for you, I'll be happy <laughs> to make sure you drink your water. So I'm gonna open both my inks and I'm gonna find my color lifter so I tend to work with all three open at once and I love how those caps nest too yes oh yes they nest so that you don't lose them because that is key uh you are going to need to figure out what works best for you I like coloring light first then add the dark then work with light some people like to dark and then do over with light so again this is where you want to practice 
and figure out what works for you. So I'm just going to start coloring my bunny. Zena has a water app also. Zena, drink your water. Yep, so there you go. <laughs> on the half hour and on the hour, it reminds me to have a glass of water. Um, no, the but, snowman is from the um, seasonal chumps. Seasonal chump stamp yep. set. So you want to work in small sections, but this bunny is so small, I'm not going to worry about. Uh, but if I was doing a bigger image, I might just do like an arm. Um, so I'm adding line where I think there would be shadow. So like the crux of his leg, under his belly, and I'm not doing. A lot, let me do around his tail. I'm not doing a lot of fine um, work with it. I'm really just adding the line and then I'm kind of coming back with the light. Debbie's asking, do the markers it. smell? I don't think so. Do they smell? No. They got a little bit of a smell. They're not as. If we stick it right under our yes. nose and take a yes. huge it's, whiff, yeah, you can smell it a little bit, but not as exciting as the paper pack. It's not like, yeah, and it's not like a Sharpie or something. No, uh, no. I, when I'm no. coloring, I don't notice it at yeah, all. Yeah, no, I, I, I honestly, I can't say I've noticed it. And I've colored with these all day yesterday. So, okay, so there is my little bunny, and now I want to add. So, here's some tricks. So, white. We can't color in white because the paper's already white, but white will have shadow. So I like to then take the smoky slate light. And so where his belly is um, going to be, I would say that maybe a little shading on the bottom. So I'm just going to put a little bit of gray here. Now that looks stupid. So <laughs> I then come and I'm going to take the color lifter and I'm going to use that to blend that out to make it look a little bit more like a shadow. I may have, there we go. Um, wow. And so now that, that's cool. Yep. So that'll add the that's dimension. That's magic, that little color lifter. Yes. It's like your magic pen. So now I'm also, I could do the same thing with his tail, but for fun. Jamie's, Jamie art. must've popped on late. She's asking, where can we get these? These will oh. be available in our online stores starting on November 1st. We will have all the information on our blogs on the resource page um, in about an hour after the episode. Yep. And um, you can get all the information by clicking on the links in the um, above for our blogs. There you go. Yeah. This, so, these are flipping amazing. Yeah. Very cool. Very, very cool. I, I will tell you, I'm in love. I, I just think they're awesome. So there's Mr. Bunny. I got him all his ears shaded, his tail. I did his tail in blue. Um, another way you can shade with the gray, uh, not just gray is blue. Also here, I'll do that over here. Um, you can also kind of ground him and you can kind of, does the color lifter tip get stained? It does. Is a question. But it like, will, is that like a Versamark pad it, it where will it eventually a gets a little discolored? Yep. It will not interfere with or like your, a blender pen when you yeah. use a blender pen. But the, you know, and I will do this, you know, and oh, see if we can just rub anything rub it off. off. If I did get a little extra That's a good question, I will also tell you, um, let me see if I can find a little darker color. Um, so here, now I'm going rogue. Um, you can take the color lifter, or you can take any of those, and you can go right on another tip. Ooh. And then add a little. Oh, that's a, a cool to feature. To get a little bit of color. Um, I was doing this. Michelle's asking, do you clean it after each use if you need to? I just do this. It may not always need it. It doesn't really need it. It may stain. It's not going to bother you if it stains. And Patricia says those blenders look really easy yep. to use. They're, they are I mean, they're as easy, easy as they look. And I, I like to, to use myself as an analogy. If I can do it right off yeah. the bat, anybody can do it. Yeah. I know I make it look easy when I'm doing something, but quite frankly, when I'm learning something, not so much. Yeah. Yeah. So like I said, start with the nib end. Practice on a bunch of samples and then just move over to the brush end and I think you'll be great. Whoop, I just lost everybody on this iPad. iPad out. I'll bring okay. it back out. <laughs> so let's color the woman. I want to do some rich colors. So I'm oh, going to do silly iPad. Calypso Coral because I, I, this is one of the colors I like. So again, I'm, this one I'm going to work in a little smaller section. So first I'm going to do her hat. And I'm just going to color it in the light. Am I in? Yep. yep and okay. then I'm going to use the dark, but I'm only going to add, let's see, I'm going to go over here and add to one side. And then I'm going to take the light again and bring that dark into 
the light and blend the edge. So it's a little darker on this edge. So I'm going to do under the hat here. And I think I'm just going to put the dark in there. And blend that out. Okay. This will not be my best coloring ever, ladies. <laughs> I'm standing up, hunched over. Just FYI. Um, all right, so now let's do her But I love sleeve. that you can show it that way. Yeah. So here we go. So we're and it still looks beautiful, even though Linda doesn't think it looks beautiful. <laughs> You're looking at it going, wow, that's kind of cool. Right, it's right. the same with all of the stuff I do. You know, I mm -hmm. look at it and go, really? I don't know if I like this. Yeah. And everybody looks at it and goes, oh, that's awesome. Right, and I'm right, like, oh, right. sometimes you're just your own worst critic. I, you know, it's true. So... Um, Edna, yes, these, she says, I think these color nicer than the, and the Stampin' Up! markers. They are meant to, actually. Yeah, these are alcohol-based markers. They're a little bit of a different marker than the, our regular Stampin' Right markers, and they are not replacing the Stampin' Right markers no. because they are a different type of you marker. You do not want to So, yes, they do color your... better, and they blend better, but they're made to blend. Yes, you do not want to color on your stamps with this. Like, don't color right, right, on right. the stamps like the direct would be, The direct um, stamp. You do not want to do that. Yeah. The alcohol will dry out yep. the rubber. Yeah. So this is meant to stamp. Jamie the says image she has been looking to it. sign up to be a demonstrator. Yes, you can email either myself or Linda. Click on the link in yep. the video's description, yep. and we'll be happy to give you some more information on yep. that. Yep. Come play with Team Stamp It. I know, and and hey, you know, if you do it now, you might get a yep. chance to win these. Yep. So oh, there. that's beautiful. See, and you can just keep going. Karen and says out. you're doing an amazing job, Linda. Thank keep going. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Go, so Linda. Go, Linda. That? Go. She is doing an yep. amazing job. So then I can even go in and I can take my color lifter and I can be like, oh, I really want to highlight here a little bit more. And I can, uh, let's see, so maybe along here where top of her, top of her boobs is getting uh, the light. <laughs> um, and it'll take a minute. These are, these weren't instantly be like, oh, it's lighter. But as this alcohol gets in there, it will lighten up. Also... So let's say, all right, I'm coming along, I color, I colored outside the lines. That's a lot. I don't know if I can fix a lot. You can use your color lifter to move the ink. Not necessarily, it doesn't erase, it moves it. So I'm going to take, I'm, right now I'm using my nib end, and I'm more or less trying to push the ink. You've got lots of kudos back. here on your shading that you don't think is all that awesome. <laughs> um, just goes to show how yep. how really easy these yep. are to use. Yep, and you can see I I did a huge boo boo. I don't. Know. She 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 looks like she might have a an issue. Yeah, so there we go. <laughs> it's gonna dry, but you see I'm I'm not erasing. I am pushing the ink back into. Um, that is pretty. And cool. As that dries. You won't see that blob at her butt. That is pretty cool. You know, and it will... So if you go outside the lines a little bit, that will fix that. So... Um, so Jenny is asking, is this regular paper or watercolor paper? This is Whisper White. You're going to want to use Whisper White or Whisper White Thick. Um, and I... You can use either. I've seen different people saying they prefer each. Um, it's one of those, find which one you like and try. Mm -hmm. Both of them will go through. They both and then are designed to do through. that. The, the pens are made to do that because that's Don't, part of yeah, their... Yeah, that's not a boo-boo. That's what's going to happen. All right, so let's color. I'm going to and no, me... it does not pill with, with these markers. Now, no, with a water-based no. marker, it will. Yes, yes. Whisper White was redesigned when we first came out with the blendabilities to work with this. So this paper is designed to work with these alcohol markers. Janet says, I want to dress like that. And I <laughs> want a dress to look like that on me. <laughs> Even if I had a dress like that, I wouldn't look like have that. You, I have not tried the shimmer white yet, Amy. Um, I have seen some people say it. Um, I don't know yet. I can't. I won't even comment. Amy's asking, know, how is Memento different than Stays On? They're actually, as much as they're both black ink pads, they're two completely different yeah. black ink pads. Stays On is an alcohol ink alcohol markers with alcohol ink it's like if you took water on a watercolor painting it would wash it off you know smush it off alcohol so the alcohol markers on alcohol ink would smudge so you need you need the difference oh i'm doing dark first ah. all right hold on light first i'm chatting and not paying attention <laughs> am i in i am in chat okay that so is, this is the my orchid problem every day from the orchard builder 
And again, now I'm just going to, let's see, I can turn this around. Uh, there we go. Um, so I'm just going to add dark, like the petal is above it, is causing a shadow. And then just lightly blend that out. And then I can say, hey, you know, the orchards, so they probably, you know, they, like, like they bend like this, they come up, they come up to a point and then maybe go down. So I want to put dark on the end. So I can put dark here, color this, then come back. I keep putting the color lifter away. <laughs> why? I don't know why. I will tell Faith you. Faith shared that she has been using it with shimmer paper and it's beautiful. Okay. I, yeah, I just saw some people saying they were using it. I just didn't have time yesterday to try it. Yes, see Debbie, you stamp with about. Memento e ink, not archival ink. Yes, no archival, yes. no uh, stays on. All right, so here we go. Susan, you can use watercolor paper. Um, Faith just made a note that she thinks it dries the markers prematurely. I don't have any. Um, it would probably pull more. I don't have any experience with doing it on watercolor paper yet. They're that new. So I, I you know what? Well, try it. Anybody try it. I would think the water, this is smooth. So the reason it blends is because this paper is smooth. I'm literally moving the color around and it's beautiful. I, I do not believe you can and do that. Jeannie's with asking when you switch from light to dark, does the color from the light or the dark get into the, it's actually the other way around. I think she's asking if the light gets into the dark, but really it the question matter. was, does the dark get into the light? And I, no, it doesn't. And I can even do this. They dry I can really pick quickly. Pick up the dark ink on my light marker and, you know, color that a little bit and get it a bit darker. So I want something a little bit darker. I can do that. I can pull it off the marker. And Sherry's asking, can you blend different colors together? Yes. Absolutely. Okay. She gives the example of coral and yellow. But yeah, so, you can go back and watch earlier into our yeah. um So this one here. is yellow with a coral. And then these are two um, blues. Here is uh, crumb cake. And I blended uh, calypso coral with it. Here I blend, uh, attempted to blend uh, cherry cobbler with a crumb cake it did not work it i could not get it to blend now it kind of looks cute here as i look at it in the screen like it looked <laughs> dots but it didn't blend so try them but some blend will blend better than others i will also tell you that's pool party so that's pool party light and dark that is bermuda bay light and dark this is dark pool party and light bermuda bay they they blend like butter those three Debbie's asking where the birds are from. They're from the Color Me Happy stamp set that will be available on November first. We you can go back and watch the beginning yeah, of yeah. This, um, this. The replay. This bird is from Garden from Girl. This one is the new one in the Christmas catalog. But Amy says watching you color is giving her the itch to join back up again. She wants those markers. Oh, yeah. oh my god, <laughs> we're all going crazy trying to get them. So now I'm not paying attention to what I'm doing. I'm coloring like And Lisa says, imagine all the different color combinations. No joke. Imagine yeah. all of those color combinations. Yeah. It, there's so many. It's endless. The possibilities is, are endless. And you just got to practice and try it. See? Oh, go. Oh, let's see if these two go together. Try it. So I'm not going to color this whole flower because it's quite big. But that's, you know, a it's dark. It's very therapeutic as well. It I is. The, the you know, dark on so... one end, dark on the side, light in the middle kind of gives it that bend. Like the flower is bending. So let's, how are we doing? Let me show off cards, completed cards. Yeah, with yeah, it. yeah. Let's, let's jump okay. right on over to the cards. Okay, let's stick these in here so I don't lose them. All right. So let's, so once you've done all that. Oh, oh, oh. I also want to show. Here. All right. No, no, never mind. We'll show cards first. I'm all over the place, ladies. <laughs> and gentlemen, if they, I'm, I, I don't want to assume there's not any men on here. I think there are. My I husband there watches. Actually are. So. Yeah, and your husband does watch. Yep. So we couldn't figure out the other day how to get on. <laughs> he's like, how do I get really? on Facebook? I'm like, really? of you're a software people, engineer. He's the man. But he doesn't go on Facebook enough, so he's like, uh, why isn't it just when I open your Facebook page right there? I'm like, well, because <laughs> Facebook puts a bunch of other stuff. Yeah, that's why I actually um, pin it to the yeah. top of the... Yeah. my page so that if someone has a hard time finding it that yeah. it should be the first thing you see when you go to my page so this one i made last week on my coffees and crafts 
Um, Vicky, these are sold individually. She wants to yes. know how many to a set. They're sold individually. Yep. You can get them you can, in a two pack. Yeah. But they do come. And you can individually. also get the information on our blogs yep. um, on the resource page after if you missed the beginning. Yep. So this is colored we'll with the ivory and the bronze. I then use the light pool party. I love the boots and the uh, and those smoky are, slate to the country them. living stamp set. Yes. on those boots. That is, uh, and that one. I will tell you, I have a new appreciation for a whole different set of stamp sets now because right, all the line. Right. All the line art stamp sets are now like the, my go-tos because I want to color them. And then this is one that I copied right out of the catalog for the... Somewhere that the brochure for the blendables, <laughs> blends, <laughs> blends. Um, with, this is one of the cards, so I just copied it. I'm like that. I, you know, people... It's beautiful. People paint the Mona Lisa. I copy Stampin' Up! I artisans. always, I, you know you what, know? that is one of the first places I look for yep. ideas. Best. The catalog best, and the Stampin' Up! Best. website. Here's the second one. Same thing from... That's beautiful. I love this. <laughs> and I never would have thought to stamp the background. And if I did stamp the background, I would have stamped it Old Olive on Old Olive. And that is Crumb Cake on Old Olive. And I love it. It's beautiful. It's just so stunning. And these these flowers just pop right off the... Um, so the just the, the blending is just beautiful and i love this little girl oh, this is, is the girl from garden girl um that is just adorable adorable i um, love the love the blending on that one too yeah so just i i'm so excited because i bought this set when it came out and i'm just like ah, i didn't feel like watercoloring her i'm so happy she, you're gonna see her in every color because <laughs> i just think that's Awesome. So I wanted to throw a few things in addition to the markers and you, so you need to get your whisper white. You need to make sure you have memento, but then there's other fun stuff in the catalog. There is the, let me bring you yeah, out. Yeah, back it out a little bit. All right. This is the, make sure I say it right. Just add color designer series paper. Hello. Ugh, there we go. I was actually using this for my test yeah. when I was playing with the blend abilities this weekend. Here, you, you, you don't want to stamp anything, but you want to start practicing. Here you go. Right here. Beautiful so images fun. to so start fun. practicing on. Or just, you know, color them, cut them up, and make cards out of them. Absolutely beautiful images. Then, here's a few other little tips and tricks. Oh, Elizabeth says this is inspiring me to get back into stamping. Oh, good. Our job is done. Okay, right. thanks. Have a great day. Right, no. We're done. <laughs> we're done. Thanks for joining us. No, we right. love you, Elizabeth, and we are glad that we are inspiring you because that is what we live to do. Because these are alcohol, you can now color other objects. So, basic rhinestones, you just color Awesome. Over. Awesome. Rhinestones are now orange. Awesome. So, and now they match because I've been match. doing that with Sharpies and they don't yeah, match. No, they don't. And they stick out and I'm like, oh. Your perfect white accents. Again. Of course. That's awesome. You don't know. Oh, wonderful. Every color. Every that's color. Great. They're now going to match your project. Pearls. Same thing. I think I already colored one somewhere. I usually color these with Sharpies. Again, I get the orange. Um, so you get a little bit of different look than the um, white perfect accents, but oh, those are colored in orange. Love it. Done. Ah, I'm coloring Tammy's woodwork, and I said I wasn't. <laughs> That's all right. Your clear, fast. Oh, I gems. never would have thought to have done that. See that one's in green. I'll this is what this, this is orange. what Linda is for. She's a genius. Now I have an orange one. Oh my gosh! That? So these are all the things you're going to add onto your order now that you've. Added. I don't need those. <laughs> Hold on, I got more. All right, where's my paper? This is the, I've said this before, I never get it. The silver metallic edge ribbon. Okay, am I in? Can we zoom in? Okay, it's like butter. So now I have an orange ribbon that will match. Stop it. You know, and you go, hey, you know. Stop it. I needed a yellow ribbon. Uh -huh. you know? Go, Rhonda, you must have jumped on here a little late. Yes, no if you worries. need an if you need an October paper pumpkin kit, um, okay, I haven't checked my email since we started, but at the beginning <laughs> I said I had a couple of extras. Yep. The first ones to email me, not post here, but email yep. me at Tammy at stampwithtammy.com. I will So the, the I, will, I will give you the information that on you that. You can do with these markers are unlimited. Give me another couple days, I'll probably come up with a few more. <laughs> so um don't just think, well, I'm just going to stamp and color the paper. Nope. nope oh, there's nope, so many nope. wonderful things you can do there. 
other stuff. I think that's all I got. <laughs> and, and tile coasters too. I'll have to do another. I oh, did those yes. a few years ago. Yes. And you know, you can color on the tiles with yeah. them. And, and Faith mentioned you can color on the window sheets. Yeah. So, oh God, yeah. Like, so many things that you can do now. We have so many possibilities. Options are open now, ladies. So <laughs> exciting. So that was just awesome. Thank you, You're Linda. very welcome. And um, I was very zen it, all yesterday. Color. Yeah, I know. I, I think I needed to do that. I I know. Know. <laughs> while it's pending, I had I got I got a notice um, just about five days ago that said, um, by the way, you have jury duty on call for three weeks. Three weeks. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Don't my be God. surprised if we say the scamp and scoop's got to be moved. So there <laughs> might be in the in the month of November there may be a lot of my online classes and, and the scoops may be actually changed. So we're doing an evening scoop. Yeah, <laughs> you might need just stay tuned to our. Facebook pages for updates we'll on update. dates and times in case that, you know, like in case I have to go into Boston oh every day or God. something happens. It's a nightmare. So yeah, good time. Yay for service, good but times. right, right. Bad I'm, timing. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do the onstage event yet either because that's falling over that time period too and it's in Salt Lake City. So I'll go for you. I'll pretend I'm Tammy. Yeah. Hi, I'm Tammy White. No, They'll no, never know. No, it's no blonde. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, it is time for some giveaways. Yay! So um, <laughs> we have three live stamp sets, hostess stamp sets that, uh, that we have here to give away for you guys. If you've left a comment, oh, there they are. Like, then <laughs> you are entered into this drawing. So um, if you left a comment on Facebook Live, if you are leaving a comment after live or leaving a comment on YouTube, you are be entered into our after live drawing, which we'll show you one more time in just a second. So we are going to pop over to our giveaway, which is not that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait for it. Green management. What the heck? A problem has occurred. Okay. Oh no. Well, we'll just log right back in. There. That's no just how we roll. No big deal. We can we can fix that. Enjoy doing grand jury. Is it grand? Yeah, jury? I or hope is it not. Just jury duty? It's um district. It's Boston district court. It's It's my second. It's my second jury Which duty this weird. year, but two different courts. So lucky me. <laughs> I got the lucky number. Oh, we'll see what happens. Um, I'm just hoping for the best at this point. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stress anymore. I'm like, I've got too many yeah. things going on. But don't worry, our our stamping will not be interrupted. Nope. It just might be postponed to different times. times is all. We'll figure it out. The, the famous bouncing <laughs> stamping yeah. scoop. Uh, November's just going to be a fun month. <laughs> we'll see how well you can follow our <laughs> events in our, in our Facebook page. Okay, so we are going to pick a winner here. Right. And First one we're going to pick for is In the City. So it's the In the City Hostess stamp set. And the winner of that is... Bum, 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 bum. Jessica, Jessica Lundberg. Lundberg. Congratulations, Jessica. Be sure to fill out the prize claim form, which you can get to um, at the link in this video's description. Our next one is Background Bits. All right. The Background Bits winner is Lori Chevalier. Chevalier. Congratulations, Lori. And our last winner is for... The Your Delightful. You're delightful. You are delightful. You are so delightful. We're going to give you a stamp set. Yeah, that's awesome. And that is Pamela Schubert. Pamela Schubert. All right, so congratulations to Lori, Jessica, and Pamela. Awesome, yay! You guys, be sure to fill out that prize claim form. And um, we have an afterlife drawing if you were not oh. one of the three lucky winners. And it is for the Love Today planner. Yay! So don't fret because that's a pretty awesome afterlife. That yes. is an amazing planner. We're going to draw the winner on our next stamp and scoop, which is currently scheduled for November 7th. We're if it has to be moved, fingers. we will let you know as soon as we possibly yes. do. Um, we might have a jury duty reschedule date. <laughs> if we do, we will let you know as soon as possible. And we will look forward to seeing you then. In the meantime, um, November 1st, these Stampin' Blends, the Color Me Happy stamp set and the Color Me Happy kit that we all just yes. showed will be available in our online stores and you can purchase them in your demonstrator kits. If you're a demonstrator, yes. you get a discount. If you're already a demonstrator, you'll get a discount on all of those. <laughs> There's a lot of discounting going on There's if you're a demonstrator. always a lot, I know, right? <laughs> right? It's always the best way to go. All right, guys. Thanks for joining us today. Bye.